Yes, yes, yes. You locked it with the best in the business. This is the number one international radio show in the world. This your main man, Maserati Rico, the Out to the People, trying to see what's something dope. We got special guests in the building. What's good, family? Speak up, talk what's to the world. The deal? What's the deal, Detroit? This C. What's happening, this T? We go by CT Films. You probably seen this on YouTube. Oh, y'all turn up on the YouTube? We turn up on YouTube. Tell them, tell them as we get into this interview, uh, what's the uh, tag on YouTube? Uh, you can search CT Films. Just type in CT Films. We're right there. You're going to see the logo. It's a big CT. Okay, so uh, let all the followers and fans and friends of the show know exactly what you bring to the game. Um, we do video services. You can call my style like kind of trap. Uh, we like to do like the stunt hards, the road canes, the snap dogs, just all the up and coming young young hitters in the deep. Okay, that's good. You're showing love to the people, man. You got to start somewhere. Got to. That's what's up, laying that foundation. How long y'all been in the game? Uh, all of us together, we've been doing this for about seven years. I just started doing music videos maybe in 2013. Oh, okay. So you've been putting in a little bit of work for, oh, yeah. for you know. For a minute, not too long, but you've been piping the, piping the concrete a little bit, huh? Yeah, building that uh, momentum, starting that wave, starting a new movement. Okay, we'll talk about that movement, man. Speak um, on that movement. The movement, we what we want to do, like, we don't want to just be like the average video company. We trying to branch out, we trying to do more things. Like, when you see Diddy and you see how he created Revolt, like, that's what type of lane we trying to create. We trying to bring something to the game that's not already there so we can create our own lane, do our own thing, and have people gravitate to that instead of just doing the status quo. Yeah, it's easy to fall in line and, and, and be part of the masses, but that's something that we love to bring uh, to the game, something different. Uh, be anything but ordinary, you know. You feel me, Ruby? We do everything but ordinary here, man. That's how we change the game. Um, I want to get into uh, y'all aspect of the music industry and being self-motivated. We're going to go into a we're going to go into a song or two, but uh, y'all get comfortable. Alright, this changed the game, man. Make sure y'all don't go anywhere. We're gonna step away from the mic for a second, but make sure you don't go anywhere. You locked in with the best in the business. It's whirling winds. Like, I can like fucking know something. Let's go. It's game time. I'm gonna expose the ball, baby. It's the new Worldwide Court Radio. This your main man, Mozzie. He wants to change the game. That's Miss TMZ over there. Look at like new money. Hey, right, Ruby, can I hold some to the 33rd? I got you. You got me? I got you. We got some family in the building. What's up, babies? What's the deal? Man, y'all talk to me, man. Y'all know something? How y'all feel today, man? It's a beautiful day outside, isn't it? Yeah, it's uh, coming back out finally. Yeah, um, before we went to break, I was uh, asking a question about you guys being self-motivated. Inform me exactly where you stand with that motivation. Because in this business, uh, without that self-motivation, uh, you might as well hang up the towel. So uh, I want to know exactly where you guys stand um, in, the, in the industry with that self-motivation. I mean, I really feel like for you to really get out here like you want to, you just got to stop doing everything that don't got to do with the number one goal. And once you put your focus on that and start seeing like the benefits and what you get from like putting that hard work in, like that's what self-motivated is being about is being able to wake up in the morning and say I'm gonna go get it no matter what like whatever dream you got just go for it like don't let nobody hold you back don't let, let nobody say well maybe you should wait or maybe you should hold off on that like just go for it because the first step to getting anywhere is taking that first step yeah that's like they say that's the hardest step is the first one but once you, once you make that advancement um, you gain somewhat of a rhythm and then you get your momentum built up before you know it you off and running a wise person told me a long time ago, if you want to fly, you have to let go of everything that's holding you down. Yeah. Um, talk to me about the music industry, because I, I know you guys do uh, you do films. Yeah. But what's the, the aspect of the music industry? With the music industry, like I feel like we got an insight to it because a lot of times I see where the trend's going. I see what people like trying to do with their music, and with us doing videos and stuff, like we get the full force of that. Uh, artists send me songs all the time, like, hey, what you think about this? Uh, would it be a cold video for this? What they doing in the industry that's like outside of Detroit? So that's basically like the industry as a whole. Like I feel like Detroit has got so much exposure in the last maybe three years just because of a lot of people that's been getting picked out of here. And everybody at a point in time right now where it's like, all right, we got to get our sound like outside the city. Yeah. And that's major because it seems like there 
And I've been talking to a lot of MCs uh, here in the city that, that have moved outside of the city and became successful. It's a sound here in Detroit that uh, only really Detroit is interested in. Like when you go other locations, they don't really pick up on that music. So you have to bring some form of a flavor that will be well-rounded for not just this city, for, for everywhere. This is changed the game. Look, I want to know about the video aspect and how they can get in contact with you if they are interested in film. Uh, if you want to find us, like I said, we on Instagram at CT Films, on Twitter, CT Films 313. Go on YouTube, look us up. We everywhere. If you see that CT logo, that's us. Oh, that was pretty easy. <laughs> hey, listen, man. Uh, I definitely want to uh, sit down with y'all before y'all get out of here, man. It's a lot that we need to discuss, man. Um, matter of fact, stick around, man. We're going to go to this song, man. We'll be right back. Change the channel. Talk to me, guys. What's the deal? This is CT Films. What up, 313? What up, Detroit? Seven Mile. Oh, man, you know what it Seven is. Seven Mile. Four life, four life, four life, four life. Y'all rocking with me, man. I'm loving it. Look, we're, gonna have, we're talking big business, man. Um, I'm looking forward to putting that video together after we talk to upper management, right? Is that? Yes. That's how that works. Upper, upper management. Yeah. You and your artist. Yes, sir. Shout out to your artist. That was Shout hot. out. She's cold. That's that's what's up. Um, once again, before we uh end the interview, tell everybody how to get in contact with you and how to see your work. All right. If you want to see my work, go to YouTube, search CT Films. Uh, follow me on Twitter and Instagram. On Twitter is CT Films 313 and on Instagram CT Films. Make it real simple for everybody. That was simple, wasn't it? Very simple. Yeah, if you don't get that, then you, don't, you ain't gonna get that. <laughs> you just lost, failure. How's that feel? Yes, yeah, lost. <laughs> hey man, I want to thank y'all for stopping in, man. That was, uh, that was a good interview, I think, man. I think I, um, I'm really excited about uh, what we got in store, man. I'm gonna have them come out probably one of these good weekends and just turn up and just put it all over every social network. Oh yeah. Black Planet. MySpace. MySpace. <laughs> We're gonna hit oh, Google me. De Google me, bitches. <laughs> Google me. It's a world around here. It's world on Wednesday, man. Once again, I'm gonna thank y'all for stopping through, man. Cut, cut, uh, I forgot one of mine. Oh, don't do How you gonna leave you, all this? You feel me? Like, my team's so loyal. I, man, show without, some love to the team. Without my team, I would be nowhere. Like, I, can do, I can't do this by myself. I gotta shout out Tony, Tony Millions. I gotta shout out TA. I gotta shout out Jared. I gotta shout out Misi. I gotta shout out Katie. And I gotta shout out the twins. Y'all make this work, not me. Oh, that's what's up, man. Because if, if, if you don't take care of your team, then it's gonna fall. It's, it's like your foundation. Uh, you can tell a good boss by his team. You know, uh, no, a wise big individual. Big. Shout out to Unc, man. Free meet you, man. But uh, you can tell how the team go. If you know, if you got a, a robbing ass boss, you gonna have a robbing ass team. You got a lying scurvy ass boss, you have a lying scurvy ass team. So <laughs> you gotta take care of your squad, man. We definitely respect that here, man, because this is a family orientated uh, radio show, and radio station overall, man. But once again, I want to thank y'all for stopping through, man. No, no, no. That's magical, man. Stay locked in with the best in the business. Monday through Friday, 4 to 6, and we're going to talk. We actually going to take some photos. Everybody that's tuned in, we're going to take some photos in front of the uh, World Wide Court backdrop. We're going to send them out there and everything. You know what I'm saying? Y'all might want to play with, with my ponytail or something. You know what I'm saying? We're going to put those pictures up. You know what I'm saying? And, and get this work popping off. You know what I'm saying? Let's get it. Let's get it, baby. Change the game, baby. We'll be right back.